when you walk around Dinosaur Provincial Park, you have to realize that the from the bottom of the valley to the top of the valley at prairie level, there are roughly two and a half million years of history. McGill University researchers flew drones over Alberta's Dinosaur Provincial Park to prove that the current method of dating fossils is not as accurate as it should be. A lot of the data we have right now comes from simply measuring how high one, uh, let's say, skeleton is relative to a very visible contact between some of those uh, rock layers. And what we're arguing now is that we can't always rely on that. The drone-assisted 3D models offer a new and more reliable way to study fossils. This new wave of technology enables researchers to survey vast remote areas of land faster and more accurately than ever before. The, the main reason that we're doing all this to find drones and uh, sometimes pretty, uh, in, in pretty rough uh, conditions at times is that ultimately we want, to, we want to understand even better how that ancient environment back in the Cretaceous changed over time because we can basically prove whether our previous you know, interpretations uh, of you know, extinctions and new species were right or wrong. For the Canadian Press, I'm Willie Easton.